वेलकम बैक यू वाचिंग द मनी शो विथ मी कविता थपलियाल एंड द प्रथोरा ऑफ फंड्स अवेलेबल इन द मार्केट टू इन्वेस्ट योर हार्ड ऑन मनी इन बट हाउ डू यू असेस इट इज़ द राइट फंड फॉर योर पोर्टफोलियो व्हाट आर द क्राइटेरिया सेट वन शुड लुक एट एंड टू हेल्प यू नेविगेट टू दिस मेज टुडे आई हैव विथ मी हेमंत तुस्तेगी वाइस इन वेस्ट एंड ऑल्सो डू नॉट फर्गेट टू सेंड अस योर पोर्टफोलियो क्वेरीज ऑन आर व्हाट्सएप नंबर विच इज एट सिक्स फाइव सेवन नाइन सेवन फोर फाइव सेवन वन यू कैन ऑल्सो ई मेल अस योर क्वेश्चन ऑन द मनी शो एट ई टी नाउ डॉट टी वी हाई गुड इवनिंग हेमंत एंड वेलकम टू द शो Uh, we also have our viewers connected today on the phone line, and the first question is coming from Hatab from Bangalore. Uh, hi, good evening, sir. Thank you so much for sending us your question. I believe you have a couple of funds in your portfolio already: Mira Asset Large Cap, Parag Parag Flexi Cap, HDFC Mid Cap, uh, Nippon India Small Cap, and ICICI Pro Value Discovery. Uh, the uh, the SIP amount is thirty thousand. Yes, good afternoon, madam. Uh, this is correct. Yes, uh, currently I'm investing thirty thousand per month. All right. Uh, all right. Into all, into all so, the portfolio. Yeah. So, could you also tell me your uh, investment duration or the time horizon that you want to stay invested for? Yeah, I am. I am uh, trying to continue it for as long as I can. Maybe fifteen plus years. Fifteen plus years. Yeah. Okay. All right. So let's quickly go to Hemant. Hemant, what will be your suggestion as per the fund mix? Well, Kavita, clearly, like he, as he mentioned, his time horizon is uh, you know at least fifteen years. So obviously, investing in equity fund through SIP is is the best strategy because when you are investing for such a long time horizon, uh, you know your aim should be to uh, earn positive real rate of return, which is what equity can give. So I think in terms of strategy, is doing all right. Uh, overall, I would say the fund selection is quite good. But I think it's equally important to understand that uh, the allocation to different market segments should be such that there is the right balance, and you kind of benefit from the potential of uh, all the segments, uh, market segments. In this case, what I'm see, what I see is that there is a large cap fund, there is a flexi cap fund, and there is also a value fund. All these three funds are investing predominantly in the in the large cap. So almost you can see that twenty thousand out of thirty thousand uh, is going into the large cap. Maybe some exposure to mid cap may be there, but Broadly, you can see that allocation to large cap is much higher. I think there is a scope to actually reduce the slight exposure to large cap and maybe increase to the mid cap. There are two ways of doing it. Either you can kind of uh, you know take out money from there and go into a pure uh, uh, mid cap fund. But I think better thing would be to create to keep some flexibility and go for a larger mid cap fund. So my recommendation would be that you can consider stopping his SIP from the large cap fund, uh, which is the Canada Tobacco large cap fund. And uh, invest that money into uh, a large and mid cap fund, which could be uh, Motilal Rose Fund, for large and mid cap. I think that would be the good strategy. Create the right balance between exposure to uh, different market segments. All right, uh, Hemant. Let's move on to our next viewer's question, which is from Karthik in Tamil Nadu, and he's uh, uh, he's a first-time investor in mutual funds, and he's also confused about uh, uh, the fund selection, and uh, he is actually planning to have a post-retirement corpus of almost five crores, and uh, he wants to start an SIP of two thousand rupees right now. He's thirty-six years old, and uh, he wants you to suggest him uh, the right kind of fund mix for twenty thousand per month. Well, again, I think looking at the time horizon, uh, investing in equity fund would be a good option. So, as I mentioned, I think it's important to ensure that your allocation to different market segments should be such that you have the right balance and also benefit from all the market segments. So, maybe uh, a, a combination of a multi-cap fund, which could be Kotak multi-cap fund, uh, a mid-cap fund, which could be uh, Nippon India growth fund, and a small cap fund, which could be Quant small cap fund, and a flexi cap fund, which could be. Or up or flexi cap, so maybe invest five thousand each in these four, and as and when he decides to increase the amount, he need not actually add any further fund from this. He can actually increase the amount in these four funds. I think uh, with that, it's time up on the show today. Thank you so much, Ayman, for being on the show and helping our viewers with their queries. And on that note, uh, uh, time to sign off. But I'm going to leave you with our WhatsApp number and email ID, where we keep waiting for your portfolio queries, and uh, we can answer, we get them answered live on our show to our experts. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.